Hey everybody. Um, look at this. So we have a barge. We're in the River Rhine. And it is just a full barge. Full of John Deere. So this is like the main way. Six hours are transported. They come out of the factory. The factory's literally only around the road. And they come down here to this harbour. And they get loaded onto the barge and that sails up through the river Rhine up towards um, the main ports in like Belgium or whatever where the tractors go absolutely wherever and then on the return journey back down uh, any of the uh, American made Waterloo tractors uh, come back here for distribution so there's eight hours there's seven hours all sitting here ready to be distributed now this port or this handling facility in Mannheim um, mostly John Deere's I think I think it's uh, roughly 200 uh, Deere's per barge so there's an upper deck and a lower deck and I think um, I think uh, it makes two journeys per week just look at all those tractors destined for a and there's what I mean, you can see the bottom deck if I go down these steps here. There's the bottom deck, look. How cool. That is really, really, really cool. What a way to transport the tractors when you think about it. So can two levels, they can put like two hundred in each boat I think and then they also uh, distribute lorries they take lorries and, and different bits and pieces as well but that's the main thing I, I, this is just blowing my mind in the distance you can see a few eight hours sitting ready to go out there's a little space there I don't know if that's going to be filled up or if it's to do with weights distributions or maybe other something else goes up on there I don't know Maybe we'll see it travelling up the Rhine later, I don't know. It's a great way to move a lot of tractors. They have 400 a week on average. Travels up, makes it so much easier to move them around the rest of the ports around the world. There's Brunswick, Baltimore. What else? Baltimore. I have no idea where that's for. Japan. How cool. How cool. And the amount of John Deere tractors in here is just unbelievable. So these guys have just arrived in the van. They're all taking tractors each. And they're all going to go and put a load more on the barge. <laughs> Five. You wouldn't think it. <laughs> Crazy. So, if we dander over, we can probably see them loading. There he goes. And the barge is so cool. So we must be able to deck it. Left it up, and that's how you can put them up on top. Where are these guys are coming. And let's get in there for tea. This is the forensic. Very cool, very cool. So, I'm going to try and get you a different perspective on this barge. Yeah. So that is what moves 
all the deers. Wow. <laughs> that is pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Oh, they've like a ramp in the middle of the boat as well there, I see. And there's a car in there. And the, the, the bridge is at the top end, and then down here, the, the bottom end, I don't know if they can have room to go between at all. I'm unsure. This guy comes in the van, takes them on a bag out to lift the next load. Cool. What do you think, Chris? <laughs> but look at this area. So there's a lot of barges, I think it's thousands of barges operate on the River Rhine every day, transporting goods. And this is just one of them. Boo! How you doing? Ha <laughs> ha! How cool is that? It's the coolest thing, isn't it? I, I can't believe it. And the chances of seeing it, twice a week. Twice a week, 200 tractors, each time. And us Egypts are standing on the edge of a pier looking at it. Well, I'm whipping up and down the staircase inside the quay and all sorts. It's cool. But it, it's a very efficient way to move tractors though. You think about it, what it would cost. So if you have 200 tractors twice a week, that's 400 in total on average going up the river, whatever's transported oh, direct is transported direct. So 400 going up, you divide that into an average of three tractors. 130, 133 unit lorries. So you take 133 lorries can be cut into two trips. For that part of it. Have you noticed how there looks predominantly four cylinders on the top and the yeah. six cylinders downstairs? Well that would make sense. Yeah, for the weight. I know that's a four cylinder. Uh, four cylinder. But there's, but down the back here, there's a the bigger six cylinders. But the lower you can put it, the better. Yeah. yeah. See how far she's in the water? That yeah. end compared to this end, because it's got, there's more weight that end. As part of the row row group, I think they run the two that do all the deers now. Doesn't look that old, or maybe they're just good at keeping it in good shape, I don't know. It's lovely and tidy. Very tidy. It looks like it's got a fairly fresh paint. Do you have any idea how long it takes to take it up? Is it two days, three days, a week? I don't know. Do you see a problem? The, the challenge. Oh, we may be able to ask the man in the office. The challenge would be I can't. My German skills aren't good enough to ask the captain of the ship. <laughs> Otherwise, I'd ask you. Mad. Brilliant.